Over the past three years, we have hired 273 employees and placed them in 200 businesses across multiple industries in SaaS, agency, and coaching space. And no, these are not three dollars per hour freelancers from the Philippines. These are the most high value and productive staff that go on to take on key roles in those businesses and allow them to grow efficiently and rapidly. After years of trial and error, I can confidently say that we've gotten the hiring process down to a science. So in this video, I'm going to reveal to you the best hiring strategy that you can use to source the best employees that will allow you to build a business that can run on autopilot without your input on a day-to-day -day basis. Figure out where you need to hire for. Nobody knows your business better than you do. Nobody will ever care for your business more than you do. But don't you ever make a mistake of thinking that nobody can do the task that you do better than you do. If you ever want to get out of that micro operational tactic level, you absolutely should learn to let go and delegate. This can be a difficult task even for the executives in the large corporations, but these are also the executives that end up being overworked and burnt out. Get yourself out of the trenches and finally give yourself an ability to look at that ideas and backlog card on your task board. Those are the ideas that you've written down that will help your business yield significant financial results, but you never end up having time to review them and execute on them. Do a time audit. Diagnose and study your daily workload. What is your 80-20 distribution? What are the 20% of the tasks that you're doing that are the most high leverage? And what are the remaining 80% of your tasks that are efficient only by 20%. If this task can be an SOP, it has to go. Apply personality tests. Meyer Briggs, 16 personalities, disk assessment. These tests will help you map out a perfect team structure that will be compatible with your managerial style and will fit your personality. Create a portrait of your ideal employee and imagine how this work should be built. Getting a large pool of applicants. You never want to be strapped by choices. It's better not to hire at all than settle for a mediocre employee. You can only get the quality of candidates that you desire by casting a wide net. Having a few hundred candidates in a funnel is an optimum to find the right talent. There are different avenues that you can use to find applicants. Referrals and referral bonuses, word of mouth and social media, especially if you have large following, job posting websites, specifically those for remote workers, professional communities and chats on Telegram, Upwork, Freelancer.com, Fiverr. As you know what you're hiring for and who's your ideal candidate, you need to create a strong job description. A well-crafted job description is essential to attracting the right candidates and ensuring a successful hiring process. Clearly state the position and the title that you're hiring for, outline the key responsibilities, list the qualifications, outline the required skills, education, and background. Mention any negotiables if you have them. If you have any non-negotiables, make sure to mention those. Also describe your company, your culture, your mission, and your values. If you can, state the compensation range and also provide context, application instructions, and a deadline. Streamline the interview process. What are the questions that you should ask and what are the things that you should look out for during an interview? Learn about the experience and background of the candidates. What are the tasks and projects they have been handling in their previous roles? Have they worked with clients or businesses in your niche or industry before? What software and tools are they proficient in, especially those related to the role? How did they manage their time? How they prioritize? How do they make sure that the deadlines are met? Could they give you an example of a complex task that they have completed in the past? What is their ideal relationship with their manager and with their team? Can they share an example of a challenging communication situation they handled in the past? And what are their long-term career your goals. How does this role fit into their plan? Clarify your role expectations. If you expect them to jump in and learn the business quickly, if you expect them to speak to the clients on your behalf, or you expect them to be available 24-7, outline that as soon as possible. Pay attention to detail. Observe their punctuality, appearance, professionalism. Are they responsive? Are they flexible? Keep in mind what are the top three things that you're looking for in an employee and what are your personal green and red flags in a candidate. By this point, you should have narrowed it down to three, four A players that are a good fit for your company. Follow up interviews. Follow your gut to place the last employee. It should just click. Secure your decision by doing a reference check, getting them to speak to your team, or giving them a test assignment, or even doing a bar raising session when you intentionally try to scare them away with challenges. Brief overview of the mindset to be in while placing employees. It's essential to work out a plan on how you will be onboarding and training your employee. Yet, it's also essential that the person that you're hiring is proactively seeking ways to get themselves onboarded. Observe how the person is doing in their first week. Are they trying to learn the business quickly? Are they trying to get to know as many people as 
as possible? Are they trying to jump in and bring value from the very beginning? And that's the best hiring process that you can use to find the best employees for your company. With this process, you can absolutely go out and start finding talent for your business. But in practice, most of the things that I've said in the video are much harder to execute. Finding applicants for your role is almost impossible with websites like Upwork or Fiverr because of the high volume of low quality candidates that will flow you with generic cover letters, not even reading carefully through the job description. Most resources advise freelancers to apply to at least 50 positions per day and send out at least 50 cover letters per day. But if you apply thoughtfully, you can only apply to three openings per day. The interview process will take weeks if not months because of the sheer volume of applicants that you need to go through. And once they're placed in your business, there is no guarantee that they will stay with you for a long time. This is not accounting for time constraints, communication and technical issues that you might face. The best way for you to avoid the struggles and still hire the best team members is by outsourcing the recruitment. HireUA is an international hiring agency specializing in placing high-level, trained and experienced Ukrainian talent into businesses like yours. We use our referral network and reputation to get the large pool of applicants, conduct interviews, do background checks and streamline the interviewing process for you. Instead of spending weeks and weeks on recruitment, HireUA can help you sell and jump straight to the interviews with two to three top selected candidates that will fit in and start making a difference in your business within a week from now. Go to hire-ua.com and book a call with our team to experience wide glow hiring services. Also click on this video right here if you want to learn how to save 70 to 80 percent of your hiring costs in just five days. If you like this video hit the like and subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one.